everyone. Mike is developing a proposal for a new trapezoid park. The figure on the next slide um, shows, uh, it's not below, it shows, I'm just going to take this all out, shows his scale drawing of the proposed park with three side lengths and the radius of the merry-go-round given in inches. And what we really need to know um, is the scale is one inch represents 1.5 feet. Just remember that. Now, I drew the park. It's not that great, but uh, we have to answer three questions, and they want the area in square inches of the scale. So um, I kind of uh, drew this line here, and here's your various, um, um, you know, things that would be in the park, like a sandbox and a slide and a climber. And this one right here would be the merry-go-round. So they just want the area. So I drew this uh, line down here. And I'm going to add the area of the triangle to um, the area of the rectangle. So the area of the triangle is one-half base times height. So the base of this is 40 minus 25. I mean, 40 minus 28, which is 12. So this part would be 12, this part would be 28, and the whole thing equals 40. So that's going to be um, 1 half, base is 12, height is 16. All right, and then we're going to add that to the area of the rectangle, which is 28 times 16. So when you multiply this out, you're going to get um, uh, the area of the park is 1 half of 12 is 6. And so 6 times 16 is 96 plus the rectangle is 28 times 16, which is... Um, to 448 and you add this together and you get 544 and that's going to be inches squared inches squared we don't have to convert thank goodness all right the next one says mike's proposal includes sawing a fence on the perimeter of the park what is the perimeter so, again, we have these little shapes in here, but we don't have to worry about those. Um, we just need to find this length here. So, um, we knew that this side was, this this part is tw uh, 28, therefore this side is 12. And this would be a right angle, so if you do the little triangle here, and you need to know your triples, thy green triples. We have 12, 28. If, um, I mean 12 and 16. If I divide both of these by 4, I would have a triangle that would be 4, 3. And this is a Pythagorean triple of 4, 3, 5. So this has to be a multiple of 4, which is 5 times 4, this side is going to be 20. So make sure you know your triples before you take the uh, PSAT or ACT. So then you just add these up, so you get 28 plus 16 plus 40 plus 20, and that gives you 104 inches but they want in feet. Now remember one inch on the drawing represents 1.5 feet. So what you're going to do is multiply this by 1.5 and that's going to give you 156 inches for the, uh, I mean feet for the perimeter. And the last question says um, the length of the south side, so this is like um, 
north, south, east, west. So this is like north, south, east, west. And so they want to know what percent the length of the south side, which is 40. So this is your south side. This is your north side. Um, so the south side is what percent? So I'll just put X percent of the north side, which is 28. So you divide both sides by 28. You get 40 uh, divided by 28 and get your X. And that gives you uh, 40 divided by 28 gives you approximately uh, 1.4857 and if you uh, multiply that to get your percent you multiply that by 100 so you get um, the percent I'll just put the percent equals 1.42 move the decimal points over when you multiply by 100 um, point, um, this was actually 85, 85, so point 85, and that's your final answer, and that's it, thank you, have a nice day, bye-bye. <laughs>